Hey, this is Jay with Secret Gaming. Happy Zer Day, happy Friday. How in the world are you guys doing? Zer is at the tower straight ahead here. And as we're heading back here, just wanted to remind you that I released my weekly Nightfall video. That's the one where I do it with my son and subscribers like you. So if you want to check that out, just click on the link at the end of this video or you can go to my channel page at any time. But uh, first up, we've got Legacy Engrams. Remember, you cannot infuse these to current light levels. But if you do buy this and there is a current version available, you can go to the armor kiosk and buy that there. Otherwise, I'd steer clear of these but uh, first up we've got the no backup plans and this of course for a titan you get force multiplier shotgun kills trigger force barrier and force barriers duration is increased so i like this for pvp mostly i don't really use it as much in pv so if you're a pvp player and uh, you like shotgunning definitely pick this up but uh, 91 percent stat roll too so not too shabby but increased intellect increased strength rain blows momentum transfer shotgun loader and machine gun loader Next up, we've got the Skyburners Annex. This is, of course, for your hunter, and you get a versatile shooter. Heavy weapon kills have a chance to generate orbs. Orbs collected when your super is full have a chance to grant special ammo. So this is a PvP, or I'm sorry, a PvE weapon or piece of armor in my uh, book. I never use this for PvP, so uh, if you don't have this and you're a PvE player, and a team player, it can definitely come in handy. 86% stat roll, so not the greatest, but we've got increased intellect, increased strength, ashes to assets, heavy lifting, and innervation. Then last in the armor, we've got the Starfire Protocol for the Warlock. Uh, you gain an additional fusion grenade. Yes, that's it. You gain an additional fusion grenade. I never use this. Um, just can't think of a good reason to use this. Maybe PvP players, if you're running fusion grenades or something like that but uh, otherwise I just think this is uh, not that great but you get increased discipline, increased strength, special ammo, heavy ammo, that's good, uh, arc burn defense and solar armor. And then uh, the No Land Beyond. Some people are going to be happy about this that have never gotten it or haven't had a chance to get this. Uh, but this is primary care. Exotic sniper rifle can be equipped in the primary weapon slot. Um, CQB ballistics, soft ballistics, accurized ballistics, mulligan missing a shot has a chance to return ammo directly to the magazine. Uh, we've got lightweight, snapshot, flared magwell, and then the master. Increased precision damage. Kills briefly increase damage against the next target. So um, you definitely want to use this in PvP over PvE, but I tell you what, it takes some skill to use this weapon in my opinion, um, but definitely pick it up if you don't have it. But we've got the Undiscovered Country, you can check that out. So that looks pretty cool. Yeah. So yeah, pick that up if you don't have it. Now besides that, um, in the weapon bundles, we've got the Bad Juju and Hoodoom. And uh, Bad Juju is an interesting weapon, can help you get your super faster, and also pretty good at killing uh, mobs of uh, enemies and everything like that. Telesto, every once in a while that comes in handy when you're doing a uh, Nightfall, so if you don't have these two items, definitely pick them up. But other than that, we've got uh, Glass Needles. Remember, these will let you reload your stat rolls for your exotic pieces of armor. Um, I don't know if I said this, 91, uh, 86, and 88. That's the stat rolls on those. But uh, other than that, we've got uh, three of coins, heavy ammo cakes, upgrades for your sparrow. You can trade in seven strange coins for an exotic shard or two for one mote of light. But that is what Zer has to offer. Let me know what you guys got going on. My wife and daughter are back. They went to Notre Dame for a twirling competition. So I'm looking forward to spending some time with them. But I uh, hope you guys have an awesome weekend. As always, take care and God bless.